Mix it up, folks! Mix it up! Hey everyone, I'm Alicia. And I'm Christian. And welcome to Eat the Pizza. And today we're making, taste testing and making, mm -hmm. chicken crust pizza. Yeah, sounds very strange. Uh, I've been coming across this pizza, real good pizza. Um, it's only four grams of carbs and 25 grams of protein per serving. I've never tried this. This is not sponsored. I was purely curious because the crust is made out of chicken. How does that even work? So what we're gonna do is bake them up, test them out, and then we're gonna make our own chicken crust pizza inspired by these. The goal is not to remake these, it's to Create an inspiration. Make our own chicken crust pizza, okay? We can do it on our own. Uh, yeah, we can do it on our own. Uh, all right, let's bake these. So now we're gonna bake these up. Now we're gonna what throw if them, I had put just... them in the oven. <laughs> went into the oven. <laughs> so we're gonna bake up one supreme, one cheese. I'm putting it on a baking sheet lined with parchment. You can also cook them in the microwave, but I read online that it was better if you bake them in the oven, so. Don't put that cardboard on there, Christian. What do you think I put the cardboard on the thing? I'm gonna save to pizza. First thought, seeing them frozen. Initial impressions, I gotta say, they look like pizzas. Okay, look at this crust. Does this look like chicken to you? It doesn't look like anything like chicken. No, it just looks like a pizza crust. Wait, it says leave pizza on board and place on baking sheet? There's can a, you, you bake, can bake cardboard? This? And it also says it for the microwave, leave pizza on board. Don't put that cardboard on there, Christian. What do you think I put the cardboard on the thing I'm gonna say to pizza? So now we're gonna put the boards back underneath the pizzas because apparently you leave them on the you board. Leave the cardboard. If Not my so sure house burns down, I'm suing this place. <laughs> Real good, good pizza, pizza co. co. We'll All see right, about you. Let's bake them up. So we cooked it for a little longer. Uh, well, actually, it was about the time it said, but I wanted it to get crispier because every time I felt it, it felt really soft. And now it looks like we overcooked it a little bit. Whoops. Uh, okay, I gotta say though, we only have two pepperonis on here. Mm, that's making me a little upset. I think there's a third one hidden down in there. Oh, maybe you're right. Yeah, I kind of see the grease. Shall we? Okay, so it seems soft. It smells like chicken. It does smell like chicken. And pizza. It smells like chicken, <laughs> like really chickeny. It tastes like a flattened piece of chicken with cheese on it. I don't even taste much sauce, but I've gotta say it's not bad. I mean, look, this actually, even though like you can see it's kind of flimsy, I mean, what do you expect, right? It's yeah. chicken. It tastes good though. But it actually tastes good. Should we try the um, Supreme? Ooh, this is better. Mm, it is better. Hmm, that's the flavor. Yeah. The flavor is better. The pepperoni and the sausage and the- And the veggies even. I would choose the supreme mm -hmm. over the cheese. Yeah. So if you could change it in your own recipe, what would you change? I think the chicken crust is too salty actually. It is a very salty bite. Yeah. All right, should we try making our own? Let's do it. For our, For our crust, crust um, we're using this ground chicken, organic, it was woohooed. Ground meat looks gross for sure. We've got our a mozzarella, salt, yep, a little bit of pep. That's our binder. Garlic powder, like about that much, and then some uh, oregano. Mix it up, folks! Mix it up! So, what do you think? One big pizza rather than the small? Yeah. Even though I actually think that was their version of the big. Yeah but it wasn't that big, was it? This is my method. And you're a sheer winner. All right, so now we're gonna just flatten this out. <laughs> feels gross. Well, it looks like a crust. I mean, who can know how it's gonna work? That's what I think, too. Time to get our toppings ready. I decided to be smart and put the onion gogs on from the beginning this time. That was so wise. I know. You look like Tom Cruise. No, I don't. From Mission Impossible 2. Oh yeah, actually I know what you're talking about for once. <laughs> what are you cutting up? 
I'm cutting up some green bell pepper, a classic piece of top. Pi uh, uh, pizza topping. Pizza top uh, class. All right, red onion. <laughs> Looks like a pizza crust. A pizza crust, okay. This smells actually really good. Now we're gonna top it with our toppings, throw it back in the oven, and then, I'm just using like regular tomato sauce. It looks like a huge chicken patty. <laughs> cheese, cheese, cheese it up. Cheese, 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 cheese it up. Baby. So we've got some pepperoni. It's a pepperoni. I'm out. We're making pizza. I love onions on pizza. Yeah, they're good. That's why. Want some olives? This looks like a pizza. I mean, I'm saying. Let's put it back in the oven. And now it's time for the pizza fact of the day. What? Did What's you know? Fact? Well, in the Philippines, KFC has introduced something called the chitza. This year, it's brand new. This year, brand new. And the crust is uh, made of a fried chicken, hence chitza, chicken pizza, chicken I would guess. Chicken pizza, chi uh, yep. And it's got a fried chicken crust with tomato sauce, KFC cheese sauce, chicken ham, cham, pineapple, <laughs> <laughs> pineapple uh, chunks, and mozzarella cheese. Beautiful. Actually sounds pretty good to me. I'm ready to try it. But I'm more, you well, know what I'm more to ready to taste? More so than that Filipino our pizza, own pizza. Our own pizza. Let's do it. And now it's time to eat the pizza. It's good. Okay, it doesn't taste as chickeny. No. I wonder, I don't know, I don't know why. Okay, so the other one tasted like a flattened piece of chicken no. with toppings on top. It was still very good, don't no. get me wrong, mm -hmm. but this is more convincing as a pizza. I don't know if it's maybe the size, maybe I don't know, it, yeah. but it's the texture a little bit too. Yeah. It's not too salty. We used tomato sauce with no salt added because we knew that we added salt to the meat and yeah. the, the cheese has salt, so. It's I think, just the right amount of seasoning. Mm -hmm. The toppings help it taste like a pizza. It doesn't taste as chickeny and it holds together really well. I yeah. mean, it's much firmer mm -hmm. than the other pizza. I'm surprised. Yeah. We will link the Real Good Pizza Co. company information in our description. This video is not sponsored by them. They didn't give us this pizza as I bought them at the store. But I thought they were pretty good. I mean, I would give them a try. I would give this a try first though. Recipe. Recipe is on our website as well as our pizza merch and all of our social media. Right cool. down here somewhere. Thank you so much for liking, commenting, and subscribing. And we'll see you next week on Eat the Pizza. It's pretty firm. Yeah, it's good. I mean, look at this. Can I just show the... the it's like, it's firm, firm. It doesn't, it's not like droopy. I mean, it's pretty impressive.